Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, we will discuss about homeopathic treatment for autism. So, are you looking for a homeopathic cure for autism spectrum disorder? So, in this video, we will talk about the homeopathic treatment of autism along with the best homeopathic medicines for the autism spectrum disorder. So, before starting about the medicine or the treatment, First of all, I would like to discuss about what exactly is autism. So let's talk about it. What is autism is a complex developmental disability that typically appears during the first three years of the life and is a result of neurological disorders that affects the normal functioning of the brain, impacting development in the areas of the social interactions and communication skills. Both children and the adults with the autism typically shows difficulties in verbal and non-verbal communication, social interactions, and leisure or play activities. And autism is one of the five disorders that fall under the umbrella of pervasive developmental disorder, that is PDD. A category of neurological disorder which is characterized by severe and pervasive impairment in several areas of development. The cause of the autism are complex and it is unlikely that there is a single cause or rather a set of triggers involving biological, medical, psychological and behavioral factors. There appears to be genetic links. Psychological assessments can be helpful, but they cannot be used to confirm or deny a diagnosis. Deny a diagnosis is medical and is made by recognizing patterns of behavior from early life which indicate, which indicate impairment of social interactions, communication and development of imagination. This is known as the triad of impairment. And at one end of the spectrum will be normally intelligent children with mild autism and at the other end will be the child with profound learning difficulties and severe autism. So this is the exact meaning of autism. I hope it is very much understandable to you people. Now let's talk about the clinical features that what are the signs of unusual development from birth to six months in children later diagnosed as autistic. So let's talk about the signs. So they are flaccid body tone, lack of responsiveness or attentiveness to people or things. Thirdly, lack of excitement in the presence of parents. Fourth, lack of anticipatory posturing on being picked up. Next, vacant and unfocused case. Next, less than normal activity. Next, specific motor deviations. And next sign is eye squint mannerism. And next symptom is predominantly irritable mood and little smiling. And next symptom is more somnolent than typical child. So first symptom of autism typically 6 to 12 months. So they are seeming hallucination excitement, appearance of self-absorption, no visual pursuit of people avoiding mother's gaze, resisting being held, arching torso away from parents, autism, stereotypes, motor mannerism, hand flipping, finger dancing movements, rocking and spinning, plastic expressions that do not communicate effect or intention. Levile facial expressions that shift from grimaces to squints. Fragmented, uncoordinated body movements. Episodes of flapping, aimless, unmodulated hyperactivity. Now, symptoms of established autism typically 12 to 24 months. So, those symptoms are child who does not approach his parents. Child keep distance from their parents. Constricted, flattered affect, little or no purposeful activity. Facial expression that does not convey meaning. Failure or normal language development. Hand flapping, toe walking, turning in circles. 
rotating and spinning things in circular motion repeats whatever is said to them that is echolalia fear of loud noises ever so these are the signs of unusual development from what to 6 month in children's and later diagnosed as at next we'll talk about the treatment now what is a treatment for autism in homeopathy now we will discuss about that so homeopathy is one of the most popular holistic system of medicine as we all know that and the selection of the homeopathic remedy for the autism is based on the theory of individualization and symptom similarity by using holistic approach so this is the only way through which a state of complete health can be regained by removing all the signs and symptoms from which the patient is suffering and the aim of the homeopathy is not only to treat autistic spectrum disorder but to address its underlying cause and individual susceptibility as far as the therapeutic medication is concerned several homeopathic remedies are available to treat autistic spectrum disorder that can be selected on the basis of family history causes sensations and modalities of the complaints For individualized remedy selection and the homeopathic treatment of autism the patient should consult a qualified homeopathic doctor in person and following homeopathic remedies are helpful in treatment of autism spectrum disorder so they are the first medicine as you can see here on the screen we have provided a picture that is ethusa sinapium so let's talk about this medicine for autism So the characteristic symptoms relate mainly to the brain and nervous system and connected with gastrointestinal disturbances. There is restlessness, anxious, disconnected, uneasy and violent behavior. Inability to think, to fix the attention. Patient is anguish, crying, an expression of uneasiness and discontent. this leads to this remedy most frequently in disease in children so this is the first medicine used for autistic child treatment for autism now second medicine for the autism is agaricus muscarius so let's talk about it so child sings talks what do not answer singing shouting muttering rhymes and professes Loquacious talk unintelligent continuously changes topic there is twitching in the muscles is a marked symptom there is a version to bark does not want to do his daily households patient talks continuously and jump over one to another topic sing talk and do not answer indifference there is great mental excitement and incoherent talking there is a mental confusion so agaricus act as a intoxicant to the brain producing more vertigo and delirium than alcohol so allowed by profound super with a decreased reflexes this is the second medicine for autism now let's talk about the third medicine that is brighter carb so let's talk about this medicine so in this patient will be having weak memory idiotic child sinus with a low confidence aversion to the strangers hide himself behind chair physically dwarf stunted growth tendency to recurrent tonsillitis this is very sensitive to cold air and the cold batter and the excellent homeopathic remedy for the children with autism who have low intelligence quotient that is iq he will be having loss of memory mental weakness lost confidence in himself bashful aversion to strangers very childish grief over trifles irresolute do not grow and develop they are backward physically and mentally very averse to meeting strangers children subject to quincy so this is the third medicine for autism Now next medicine that is a fourth one carcin Carcinosin is a wonderful homeopathic medicine for autism spectrum disorder In this child is mild ill 
hyper activity is not very marked in carcinogen patient may have interest in artwork like drawing singing coloring etc affectionate and sympathetic sympathetic patient autism in children with family history of cancer a strong history of diabetes and coronary artery disease in both paternal and maternal families child if often slow but agree and caring so this is the fourth homeopathic remedy for autism now let's talk about the fifth medicine for autism that is calcarea so in case of calcarea for patient is anemic who are peevish and irritable they have strong desire to go out traveling motion desires recurrent tonsillitis pain on opening of the mouth and infants want to nurse all the time and vomit easily craving for the salted smoked meat the next medicine for the autism is hyoscyamus so in this case patient having a low muttering speech very suspicious talkative jealous foolish and great hilarity inclined to laugh at everything and deep stupor quarrelsome uncovered body and purposeless movements no love for near ones and the next medicine for autism is calibrom so calibrom is a homeopathic medicine for the autism where child move purposelessly hand flapping fit get hands loss of memory can pronounce any word told but cannot speak otherwise night delusions and horrid illusions the next medicine for the autism is lycopodium in case of lycopodium patient is very anxious especially appear in public obstinate does not share things anticipatory anxiety desire for sweet and warm food intolerance of the cold drinks big emaciated and precocious children anger violent irritable child a person to company but need someone in house now the next medicine for the autism is phosphorus so phosphorus patient is very affectionate friendly child yielding mild cheerful patient desire for cold drinks ice cream and fruit juices constipation hard stool restlessness fearful fear of loud noises and external impressions fear when alone and fear of thunder now let's talk about the last medicine for the autism that is silesia so in case of silesia patient is very obstinate concerned about everything and homeopathic medicine for autism in children who are intelligent good in academics fixed ideas for everything profuse sweating in palm and soles very obstinate constipation defective nutrition cannot assimilate what he eat very sensitive to cold water and autism after vaccination so these are some homeopathic medicines which are used for the autism spectrum disorder so that's all for today see you guys in our next video till then stay connected with us for more videos like this Don't forget to subscribe and comment below and yes press the bell icon for more updates stay safe and stay healthy and yes thanks for watching this video